Why did Neanderthals, who had exceptional physical strength, and were the greatest predators on Earth, disappear? Humanity has evolved by adapting to the environment. Australopithecus, called the southern ape, walks on two feet, but has a curved spine like a monkey. Homo habilis, who was dexterous and made tools, became skilled at walking, hunting and gathering, and the beginning of a barbaric culture began. As Homo erectus appeared, brain capacity increased, and intelligence developed, and began using fire to cook food and keep warm. Afterwards, Neanderthals appeared, who were stronger, and had much larger bodies and brain capacity than modern humans, Homo sapiens. He was an excellent hunter who was higher on the food chain than lions. They had to eat a lot of meat to maintain their strong bodies. And they hunted and ate wild boars, bison, rhinos, and even mammoths. However, Neanderthals did not live like dull animals. Fossil pollen was discovered in soil samples from a Neanderthal site in Spain, reflecting the custom of offering flowers when burying the dead. It can be seen that there was a funeral ritual that expressed abstract thinking ability and a sense of loss. Why did the Neanderthals, who survived Europe's cold climate and the end of the Ice Age for 500,000 years, become extinct? There may be many reasons, but it was a cycle of risking one's life while hunting, overeating, or starving. Carnivores can starve to death if they do not successfully hunt to maintain energy. But Homo sapiens, who are omnivores, have an advantage in survival because they can eat vegetables and seafood without having to hunt dangerously. Looking at the state of toothware in Neanderthals, none were over 30 years old. But in Homo sapiens, the proportion of adults over 30 years old was five times higher. Additionally, Neanderthals lived in families of 10 to 20 people and did not interact with other groups to the extent that everyone outside their immediate family was perceived as enemies and prey. On the other hand, Homo sapiens had villages where hundreds of people lived together beyond the family circle. They communicated with a sense of solidarity, shared their elders' experiences with the group, and hunted efficiently by forming teams with several people. Neanderthals, who had a short lifespan, had to fill the void left by their elders, who died early. So their childhood was short, and it was difficult to maintain the population and expand the community. As Homo sapiens grew in population, they began having grandparents and were able to spend the longest childhood on Earth, giving them more time to develop their brains and learn social behavior. The secret to survival of Homo sapiens who were thinner and physically weaker than Neanderthals, was group strength through collaboration. Only the adaptable, not the strong, can survive. Subscribe and like give warm encouragement.